Hello, hello guys, I am Jack Tricken and be welcome to my channel and today I want to show you guys how I beat uh, a defense in Guild War 2.0 for the top one guild in the server. So let's take a look here. So let's go to the guild, let's see guild ranks here. Uh, this guy's mad Immortal Elite was the top one guild, right? So they are really, really strong. Uh, my guild is really strong too, but we are top uh, 65. So there is a huge difference, as you guys can see right so and yeah uh the matchmaking is not the best definitely last week we take a guild with only five members so there is no guild war and right now we just get the top one guild in the server uh that's crazy man that's crazy uh that's why because we can't attack no one here mostly can attack uh, these defenses because these guys are so strong that it's almost impossible to beat but at, at the other side they can beat us really really we uh, really really easy so take a look at that uh, here they beat almost everyone uh, I will show mine far last here they can beat everyone uh, here again they beat everyone and here take a look on that guys just my defense don't get any attack in the guild and of course uh, take a look on the video that I explain my defense let me show to you guys but I showed that with details in a video here uh, on my channel on YouTube so of course make sure to subscribe like this video and take a look how to do a good defense so you can have good results in Guild War 2 okay so uh, but now what I want to show to you guys is how I attack because uh, how to attack uh, when a, someone is so much stronger than you, right? So uh, that's the thing. Uh, we think it's all about battle power. Uh, and of course it helps a lot, but it's not. But as you guys see my defense, my defense, uh, they just don't attack my defense because they get scary about that because she looks like so good uh, and they just don't attack even with double of the power right so and about this guy here as you guys can see i beat this guy he is much more stronger than me and i will see uh, you guys will see how i did it so let's take a look here and analyze what i did of course it was a trial first and uh, i almost died because i did wrong for the first time as you guys can see but then i just use everyone in the correct time and make this happen so the first time, as you guys see, nothing. He, they just kill everyone really, really fast. And that's why uh, they use the ultimates. And now I send the second wave. On the second wave, take a look, guy. That's it. Spiders and double dogs. That's it. Spiders and double dogs just kill this guy. Uh, actually, uh, thinking right now, what just happened is... <laughs> Uh, the defender, this guy's defenders, I think, is not using Olag's wall as an artifact. And I think that makes all the difference because, of course, this is a number one tip on your defense. Uh, if you are in uh, end game or late game, you probably have some, some uh, artifacts that is Olag wall to block one more guy on your defender. And you really need to use that. Because as you guys can see here, uh, maybe if he have that, uh, I think he doesn't have. Because I send one, uh, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It was ten guys. Look at that. Uh, ten guys and he can block for... Yeah, I, I'm not sure about that. But the thing is it can be different. It's really fast. Oh no, I can, I can make it slow. Great. Like, right now we can see how it really works let's see with details what just happens here take that look that so yeah the dogs goes the spiders and that uh, only three four no four blocks here he uses four blocks so four blocks there and then two more 
on the um, on the Zilito. So it's six blocks and plus two guys that goes around and beat the defense. Yeah, that's what's happened. Uh, but yeah, I, I think you guys understand uh, my point here. It's how to attack someone. Uh, e even if you have too much difference on battle power, take a look at that, guys. Uh, this guy has 4,000 on battle power. Uh, it's too much. Of course, he is not the, the strongest one in the guild. But still, he have 11 wins and only two defeats. Uh, so it's really hard to attack. Let's see uh, what more guys here that beat this guy too. It's this one from my guild too. Let's see if he uses the same strategy or not. Let's see. I will slow down that so you guys can see better. I think he has because I had I told everyone in my guild to try to do the same thing. Oh, actually, he sent another tanker first, and let's see. <clears throat> then he sent spiders and dogs. Oh, look at that! Oh, it's because Zilito. It's really easy to kill. Oh, that was the strategy he did. Yes, Elitus is, is really easy to kill. Because of that, guys. Not a healer. Look that mistake. That's the mistake these guys did. He doesn't use the healer uh, on the correct place, right? So that's why he lost. And right there, yes, that's it. So that's uh, mostly a defensive fail, as you guys see, right? Because if he just move, uh, le let's let's analyze that just to make sure uh, everyone will understand. Uh, let's let's see here. Um, here he is, guys. Uh, if he uses the healer right there on the place of Kamet, and Kamet here in the place of the healer, uh, it will be better. Because right uh, in this time, the Zilito can take heal, so she will not die. And Kamet here will not die anyway, because there it's hard to, to hit here, right? So uh, that's why, that's what's happened. Yeah. We learned something, right? So that's it. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and learn uh, some useful tips for the next attacks. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video and see you in the next one. Bye bye.